It's slower paced here in Iroquois County, and that's a good thing. Iroquois County is a good place to establish a business. We have a lot of advantages. If you're looking to place your business along the I-57 corridor, Iroquois County could very easily be a, a hidden gem. Real estate is more affordable. Cost of living is less. Cost of capital is gonna be so much less. You're gonna have less upfront invested to start what you're trying to do. We undersell ourselves location-wise. We're far enough from the city to be out of the big rush. The benefit of being here is we're in the heart of rural America. We have a customer base that far exceeds Iroquois County. Very quick access to both Champaign and Chicago, but you're right in the middle of it. The location for us is, is a really significant part of why we do business here. There's just a bunch of places that you can get to. We're less than two hours. Chicago, Indianapolis, Champaign, Lafayette, Indiana. We have two railroads running all four directions. We have easy access to Interstate 57, Interstate 65 via US 24. We produce a unmatched product and can do that on a local level. We can do it on a regional level, national and global as well. All that's happening here in a small town of 5,000 people. We specifically place this new facility south of Gilman because we have access to two rail lines here in Iroquois County. That'll allow us to get the product in in an efficient manner and then truck it to the Heritage FS system. The logistics are incredibly important. Efficiency is a real key to our profitability. Our proximity to Chicago helps us a lot when we're looking for over-the-road trucks. That does provide a lot of access to us. Logistically, it's a very good fit for us. We service northern Illinois, southern Wisconsin, western Ohio, and all of Indiana and Illinois out of here. As we've added more and more to our infrastructure here, we've been able to find very high quality construction crews in addition to electrical, phone, cable, internet. All of those utilities have always been very eager to work with us. As a big user of electricity and many natural resources, one of the things that we have to make sure that we can be completely reliant on is that we have the services that we need, whether that's internet service, gas and electric, or what have you. We always have the things that we need to support our business each and every day. In Iroquois County, you might not think there are adequate infrastructure services like internet, electric supply. In the area, we are fortunate to have two state-of-the-art internet providers. All of our computer systems in the whole Midwest are run through here. The infrastructure is really picked up. We've got cables coming in, it seems, all the time. We're able to get pretty much any type of speed and bandwidth that we need anymore. We have a lot of land. We're sitting on a giant aquifer. We have more than adequate supply of natural gas and electricity. We're standing in front of our Lotus substation. We have facilities in and around all of the major uh, communities in Iroquois County. We serve the rural areas. We have an electric capacity to serve virtually any load that locates within our territory. We feel that our service quality and reliability are second to none. Small rural areas in Illinois, not everybody has access to um, adequate health care. Here at IMH, we have a 24-7 emergency room that's staffed by board-certified physicians. We also have a 160-slice CT scanner, which is actually the best CT scanner in about a 90-mile radius that includes much, much larger facilities. We're very proud of our emergency room staff. We have very experienced emergency physicians and nurses that are highly trained in emergency care. Our workers injury program offers excellent services to our employers in the community. We coordinate the care between the emergency room, the clinics, as well as physical therapy to get workers back as quickly as possible and try to avoid lost days whenever possible. All of these things we feel make uh, Watsika and the Iroquois County area uh, destination. Um, our goal is to be the hospital of choice and the employer of choice for Iroquois County. Gillen's Industrial Park is located just off the I-57 exit with uh, over 200 acres available. Gillen has uh, great access to rail, has all the utilities in place, power is no problem, water is no problem, sanitary sewer is already in place. We have three truck stops, truck plaza with a service area, it's just a great place to do business. We have a staff of around 50 uh, employees. We're glad for the opportunity to be able to provide jobs. I was all city boy. The job opening came up. It's been a huge culture shift for me. You're not just a number. Teamwork is a big thing. 
you would find an eager workforce. People have core values and a good work ethic. We're fortunate to have good people that work in our facilities. They have those rural, loyal roots. The base of people here are genuine, and it's something that we really put a lot of value in. The young people that come from Iroquois County are instilled with core values that are founded in the agricultural industry. They are exposed to hard work, heavy equipment, and technology. My kids were born and raised here and got a great education here. And We've always been proud of the school system. We take all walks, we take all income levels, we blend them together. What you get in Iroquois County is you get people that sincerely are gonna show up every day, that sincerely wanna do a good job and will sincerely be dedicated to you. That's what we're about. And that's why our community continues to invest in the future of Iroquois County. Iroquois County is a great place to work. It is also a great place to live. The slower paced environment of Iroquois County enables people to have a higher quality of life. And the perception would be that there's absolutely nothing to do. A lot of opportunity to golf, hunt. You know, our fishing department's very strong. We sell a ton of canoes and paddle boats, more than you would ever think. The people would be very welcoming. It becomes a huge family. It's not Mayberry, but it's, it's about as close as you're going to get. It's got great core values. What this county offers is exactly what everybody looks for. Human connectedness, people that support them, and genuinely care about their success. It's a great community to live in. I started my own business when I was about 19 years old, and it's worked out well ever since. Friendly, comfortable, a little more laid back. You see an awful lot of helping each other out. That's part of who we are, part of the culture of what's in Iroquois County. We've had many opportunities to move the business, to move our family out of the area, and we've never chosen to do that. It just feels like home. That's Iroquois County.